A few months ago, we were invited to come on the country's family reunion cruise, and in January, we flew from Nashville to Fort Lauderdale to board the ship and set sail to Belize and Cozumel. We are boarding! Almost there! Both of our daughters got to come with us on this trip, and though we'd been on two cruises as a family before, this one was special because we were not only on the boat with Larry and a bunch of country music artists we love, but we were also on the cruise with more than a thousand new friends and fans from all across the country. The ship was called the Liberty of the Seas, and it was big, and it was beautiful. Why did you bring these long socks? After getting settled in our staterooms, they pulled up the big anchor, and we headed out to sea, just as the sun was setting over the faraway city. And though we were all far from our Tennessee homes, for those few days, the ocean was filled with the sounds of down-home country music, as the ship's big showroom became the home of Larry's Country Diner and Country's Family Reunion. I remember when I was 12, I stole a dime store comic book. And how Mama read where there's... The shows were so much fun to be part of. Besides us, some of the other artists performing on the cruise were Gene Watson, Bill Anderson, Mo Bandy, T. Graham Brown, Rhonda Vincent, Jeannie Seeley, Johnny Lee, Linda Davis, Ronnie Robbins, and of course, Nadine and the whole Larry's Diner cast. Most of them we'd met before, but we all got to know each other much better by the end of the week. Every night, we'd all join together in the Grand Ballroom for a wonderful dinner. It was fun to dress up a little bit and be with so many wonderful people from so many places. I even wore my tuxedo overalls. The first port we stopped in was Belize, and we decided to stay on the ship while our two daughters went ashore for an all-day excursion. They got to fly high above the treetops in the jungle on zip lines and float on inner tubes through beautiful crystal caves. They had a ball and took lots of pictures and video for mom and dad to see. A day or two later, we arrived in the Mexican port of Cozumel. For fun, we had matching bracelets made for all of us that had our names on them. All except for me, mine somehow said, Roby. If you've never been on a cruise, you're missing out on a wonderful time. There are so many fun things to do on the ship, from swimming pools, movie theaters, workout rooms, karaoke, ice skating rinks. They even have a shopping mall built right in the center of the boat. There's nothing quite like watching the sun rise or set from the balcony of your stateroom and falling asleep to the gentle rocking of the waves. It was truly a week full of memories that our family will never forget. We hope to come back and do it again next year, and we hope to see you then, too. You know, hon, if this all were to go away, I'd just stay home and sing for you. Just like it used to be. Not planning our day around the TV set. Paying our bills and staying out of debt That's important to me That's important to me Don't forget about what's most important to you I'm Joey And I'm Rory Tune in again next week Same place, same time <laughs>